Hello Madridistas and welcome to today's interesting episode as we talk you through some very important updates at Real Madrid. Starting on today's agenda we will provide you with every information there is to David Alaba's possible return from injury right after the international break against Sevilla in a match which his experience might well be needed. Shortly after that, we will quickly turn our attention to something else as we are going to be talking about Real Madrid new goalkeeper Kepa Ariza Balaga who has publicly said he wants to sign a permanent deal with Real Madrid considering he just arrived on loan from Chelsea. But before we talk detail on that, please do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Follow us so you do not miss on our next update. The Real Madrid defense has been the root cause of so many Carlo Ancelotti's problem this season. Right from a Germany Towers ACL injury early in the campaign, matters have gone sour for the Merengue's backline. David Alaba's injury and Nacho Fernandez's suspension complicated the already sensitive department and forced Ancelotti to start Aurelien Tuameni as a centre-back against Osasuna. Marca brings some positive news with regard to Real Madrid's defensive situation, revealing that David Alaba's return is just around the corner. The, the Austrian international went off injured during the team's clash against Las Palmas last month and thus spectated the team's next three fixtures from the sidelines. Nevertheless, the Spanish publication reveals that Alaba should be fit in, on time to face Sevilla in Real Madrid's first game after the international break. Many of Real Madrid's regular have dispersed for the international break and are currently on duty with their national teams. Alaba had been called up by the Austrian national team but his name was later withdrawn from the squad on Monday and he is continuing his recovery at the Valde Bebas. The veteran was seen in a the team's training session earlier today, albeit not with the group. Alaba, alongside Adair Goulet, worked separately in the club facilities, pushing for a speedy recovery. And Slotty could not hope for a better time to recover the 31 year old star services, for Antonio Rudiger is currently the only available centre back option at his disposal. Moreover, that will be the situation until El Clasico, considering Nacho's three games suspension. Las Blancos have appealed to shorten the club's captain's punishment, but there is much optimism around the same. Alaba's involvement thus becomes more paramount than ever. So having talked on that, we are going to quickly turn the page and switch our attention elsewhere as Chelsea loanee keeper Kepa Ariza Balaga wants a permanent Real Madrid move, claiming who doesn't want to stay. Speaking in an interview with Juan Fez Sanchez of El Chiruguito TV, Chelsea loanee keeper Kepa Ariza Balaga has admitted that he would like to join Real Madrid on a permanent basis. Kepa arrived at Real Madrid late in the summer transfer window as an emergency option after Thibaut Couture ruptured his interior cruciate ligament. With the Belgian set to be out for almost the entirety of this season, Los Blancos needed a top-level replacement and decided to bet on Kepa, who was at the time on the cops of joining Bayern Munich. But when Real Madrid came calling, the Spanish international did not think twice about the move and joined the Merengues on a season long loan deal. Kepa has previously admitted that 
he would wa he wishes to remain at Real Madrid beyond his loan spell, which expires at the end of the 2023-24 season, and reiterating his stance again, again during the interview, the former Athletic Club star insisted that he is very happy at the Santiago Bernabeu and would love to prolong his stay. Yes, I am very happy here. Who doesn't want to stay at Real Madrid? Kepa said. Since joining the club, Kepa has made nine appearances across all competitions, keeping five clean sheets and letting in seven goals. While he has not always been convincing, the 29 year old has done what is needed of him so far in Coutoir's absence. Amid talks of Kepa wanting to join Real Madrid permanently, reports last month suggest that Chelsea would be open to letting him leave but will seek a transfer fee of around 25 million euros. But Real Madrid will not look to spend more than 18 million euros on Kepa if they do indeed decide to sign him permanently. With Andre Lunin's contract expiring at the end of the season, there will be room for a new goalkeeper and it remains to be seen if Kepa wishes of a permanent transfer comes to true or not. So having said that, we have come to the end of today's interesting episode. Thanks for following us right up to the end. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel. See you next time. Color Madrid to us all.